We have our first snowfall in the books. We take a look at how early or late that comes for some of us and a warming trend as we head towards the end of the week, but also the chance of more rain, maybe even snow for some. So uh, a snowy view for many of us as you woke up this morning. Here's a view of downtown Minneapolis. Uh, 2.6 inches of snowfall officially at MSP and metro totals really ranged right in that one to three inch amount. Uh, comes just a little earlier than normal. The average first date of the measurable snowfall in the Twin Cities is November 6th. So about a week early, but comes late for International Falls and right on time in Rochester. If you really average it together, this is about when we should see it. A lot of folks thinking it's early, but we just have been spoiled with a lot of mild falls lately. Uh, and this fall has been mild too, uh, no doubt. Remember October 1st, it was 92 degrees. Big contrast between the beginning and the end of the month. We're going to close it out warmer than normal, even with these last cold days. Uh, there are those snowfall totals, uh, one to three inches, some higher amounts along the North Shore. Uh, 8.4 inches in two harbors, six and a half around Silver Bay. So they got a little lake enhancement temporarily as this spin. You get that counterclockwise flow around that uh, clipper low center. Uh, just enough moisture coming off of Lake Superior times. Windy today in the wake of that system. Winds lighten up those we head into the evening. So trick or treat time should be better. Winds around 10 miles an hour, but it's still gonna be cold, uh, near or below freezing for most of us. Highs are only gonna be in the mid thirties. Uh, for the Twin Cities, Southeastern Minnesota, only mid twenties in Northwestern Minnesota. So uh, pretty chilly for the 31st of October. Normal highs about 50. Big pressure gradient or tight pressure gradient here. You can see between that high pressure to the west, the center of that clipper, the yellow lines are those pressure lines and those are bunched together. Yeah, it got a lot of wind and we have that for the first half of the day today. But as that high settles in tonight, it's going to be calmer. Also cold though. Uh, on the upper levels of the atmosphere, we've got that low that is really kind of drawing in a reinforcing shot of cold air that's going to stick around today into tomorrow. So cold night tonight, winds will lighten up, clearing skies, uh, and with fresh snow, even a little bit of it will make a difference. Probably low 20s, Twin Cities, teens outside of the metro, single digits even in northwestern Minnesota. So pretty chilly here today and as we start the 1st of November, but then that cold departs. The atmospheric flow becomes more zonal west to east, and that's a milder flow. By Friday, we're looking at probably closer to normal temperatures. I think upper 40s, even a shot at 50, especially the southernmost counties of the state on Friday. It's not going to be sunny, though. November, our cloudiest month of the year, and it's going to certainly look like that these first several days. But here are those Friday high temperatures well into the 40s. But then we're talking about a couple of systems moving in, too. That's going to help keep those clouds in place. A couple of sprinkles Friday, not a lot of rain. Saturday looks mostly dry, but then Saturday night into Sunday, Monday, another larger system develops. Rain, maybe snow. Some models are a little colder. Uh, Northern Minnesota might have to be on the lookout for some potential snows, especially in the overnight hours, Sunday night. Uh, but uh, either way, some moisture headed our way for the weekend. But uh, after today, I think we can squeeze out a 40 tomorrow. It's going to be cloudier Wednesday, then brighter again Thursday. So enjoy that sun that we have today and Thursday because we're in for a pretty dreary stretch, I think, Thursday into Monday, maybe even Tuesday next week. Several days of cloudy skies, uh, and we will have some occasional showers, it's looking like as well.